Zhang says Uganda and China have had good cordial relations for the last 60 years and this country will continue supporting Uganda to achieve its goals. We the foundation of friendship and bring a new start where we motivate stronger momentum in China-Uganda practical co cooperation. The practical cooperation are delivering more and more tangible results to the people of our two nations. Prime Minister Robin Nabanja, who represented President Yoweri Museveni at the celebrations, commended China for supporting the implementation of various projects like roads, hydroelectric power stations, hospitals, communication infrastructures, among others. We are ready to work with you on how to facilitate greater access of Ugandan products to the Chinese markets, greater access of Chinese tourists visiting Uganda, and facilitating more investment from China to Uganda. Nabanja says China was key in helping Uganda during the COVID-19 pandemic by offering vaccines, personal protective equipment, and testing kits. This framework has deepened our cooperation and our commitment will continue to be built on solidarity, mutual cooperation, respect, prosperity, peace and stability. Nabanja said Uganda plans to embark on the production of vaccines that will be used to prevent various diseases and asked China to support Ugandan areas of expertise and technology sharing. She promised to meet the Chinese ambassador to Uganda to iron out some issues regarding the problematic Isimba hydropower dam next week. China supported the construction of Karuma hydropower dam through Exim Bank. Shelly.